right, what do you know, what do you say, what do you do, my YouTube viewer is Retro Pro Frank with the final installment of the Bar Top Arcade series. Guys, we're going to fire this thing up, I'm going to show you the interface a bit, okay, and I'm pretty excited, guys, aren't you guys excited? Like, this is the first time we're going to be firing this thing up and uh, playing a couple games on it, okay? Now, there is one burnt out LED, uh, I did get in contact with that uh, uh, eBay seller, He's going to be uh, sending me a bunch of um, LED buttons and uh, a daisy chain, <laughs> which is a little bit useless now. But let's not waste any time. Let's fire this baby up and uh, let's play some games. You know, I'm thinking about maybe starting off with some Pac-Man, some of the classics, and bringing it into some uh, newer school stuff. By newer school, I mean maybe, you know, like 98, 97. <laughs> maybe get into some, uh, some classic arcade stuff. Uh, some Capcom versus Street Fighter stuff. I love me some Capcom versus Street Fighter, okay, guys? So maybe get some of that in, some classic Street Fighter. Okay, who knows? Who knows where we're going to take it to, okay, guys? So uh, I'm going to turn it up. We're going to boot it up, and uh, let's try out our fruits of our labor over here. Let's give this thing a go here on part eight of the Retro Bar Top Arcade build. Okay, you can see how she boots up here. Alright, so everything's lit up. So she does boot in Windows first, okay? But I got it set up in a manner where it goes directly into my emulator. So I don't even have to touch anything right off the bat, it goes directly in. Now some of these games aren't programmed yet, so it only takes a second to do so. So let's see how that goes. There's the Windows booting up right there. It only takes a second. Once it's booted, she's good to go. Maybe I'll uh, shut some of the lights in here for a better picture. Let's see how that looks. Alright. <laughs> I'm so excited guys. Aren't you excited? This is the first time we're going to be able to play it after that long series. Okay, so you can see how it goes directly into the user interface uh, right away. Okay, I programmed the computer to do that right off the bat. Okay, so Let's go into some of the favorites here. Maybe we'll start with uh, something simple here. But let's try out the Miss Pac-Man first. Alright, so that's the way they all boot up, just like if you turn the regular machine on. Okay, guys? So right away, because um, I haven't configured this, we're going to pause it. Okay, then we're going to go into the configurations. We're going to input this game. We're going to make sure your player one start is set. Point one is set, and the directional pad actually looks good here. So let's exit this one, and let's go into input general. No, we don't have to do that. So we're going to exit this. Let's go into the video options here. Okay, we'll make it a little bit wider. We'll go with a 7-9 image. Okay, we'll uh, back out of that. We'll go into some image enhancement. Okay, and we're going to actually use, uh, I like Super Eagle, okay? So this actually, what this, what this does is it gives you a different... A uh, bunch of em, uh, emulator enhancements, so you, it's a lot clearer picture. So we'll use the Super Eagle on that, okay? And now we'll go back into the previous menu. Now, once you do this once and you set everything once, she's ready to go, boys. Okay, so we're going to unpause it and we're going to coin up. Let's do this. Oh, yeah, baby. Love me some Miss Pac-Man. And it feels nice and tight. Oh, Jerry. Oh, oh. Don't trap me. Come on, guys. Come get me. Come get me. Come get me. One. Two. Three. Oh, finish for points. Four. Yeah, baby. Didn't even die once. Made it to the second board. Okay.
Okay, guys, so that's enough of that. Let's get into something else here. So we're going to press pause. Now we're going to go exit. Confirm our exit. Brings us back into our interface over here. This is amazing. So let's go a little bit newer. I don't know. What should we do here, guys? Um, maybe bring it to... Uh, how about Golden Axe? That was a that was a an arcade classic from back in the day. Let's check this out real quick. Might have to set the buttons because I haven't configured this yet. Look at that, guys. Let's see if we can make this look better. I'm gonna pause it up. We're gonna go to configure. I'm gonna go to video options and hyperspin. This is in hyperspin, guys. Hyperspin does operate like this, at least in the main section, okay? Let's go to video options and we're going to go to a 107. Let's see if it makes it wider. Yep, just made it wider. Okay, we're going to go back to previous menu. All right, we're going to do some image enhancements as well. Let's bring it to the Super Eagle, okay? We'll return to the previous menu. Okay, so the Super Eagle just makes all the images look a lot sharper. There's a bunch of different ones, but I like the uh, Super Eagle. So we're going to go to input this game and we're going to set the buttons real quick. So player one start, then the coin up, coin one, then player one up, player one down. Anyone with an emulator that's ever ran an emulator knows, knows how this goes. Okay, so button one, just got to configure your buttons guys. Once you do this once, it's set like this for life. Okay, so that's done. So let's exit out of this. Okay, we're going to unpause it now. All right, let's coin it up. So that's that's what it would sound like if you're actually putting a token in or a coin, okay? All right, and let's uh, press start. Some golden axe, yeah, baby. Let's get the pick between the warrior, the female warrior, the elf. I always like the warrior. Let's check out how she plays. Guess that's your buddy right there. Oh no! So the eBay seller, um, I had to open a claim actually, that's how bad it was. So the eBay seller is sending me 20 extra bulbs, 5 extra sockets for the bulbs, and 2 daisy chains. So let's exit out of here, let's bring it a little bit newer, and let's see what we got here now. Um, for those of you who like shooters, I am so terrible at shooters. We got Gradius, should I try it? Should I try it? Japanese version, 1995? Yeah, let's try it real quick. Now I gotta set the... Um, Warming up now. So this is what it did on the actual arcade cabinet back in the day. I guess it was a way for the tube TV to warm up the monitor, you know? For a good picture, you know? Alright. Alright, so let's try this out. I'm really not good at shooters. If you're a good friend of mine, you would know that. Okay, so let's... um. Let's just uh, set all the buttons real quick for this. Okay, guys, once these buttons are set, everything is simple. Okay, it's going to stay like this forever. Left. 
right. And these actually look set. So, but it doesn't hurt. You know what, guys? It takes a second. Okay, let's exit this. Let's go into some um, video options here. Let's bring it to an 8.7. No, that's actually smaller. So we'll go to a 4.3. Exit out of this. We'll go to image enhancements and we'll bring it down to Super Eagle. Now, watch the difference here, guys. I don't know if you guys can see it because it's a little faded. Look at look at the, the lettering and everything. Now when I press pause, that the Super Eagle is going to kick in. I don't know if you guys noticed that, but it's like a big difference. So let's coin up. And I suck at shooters, guys. So let's try this out. So that's that. I have to get at least one shooter in there. Okay. Um, let's try something else, guys. This is pretty cool. It's called Haunted Castle, but it's really Castlevania. Should I show you guys this? Should I show you know what? I'll show you guys this real quick. This is called Haunted Castle, but it really is Castlevania, okay? Look at that. Castlevania. Alright, let's start configuring this one. So input this game, player one start. Player one start, sorry. Point one. Alright, so up, down, left, right, button one, and button two. Okay, so we'll exit out of this. I'm gonna go to video options, see if we can make this any big, bigger. 8.7? No, that's smaller, right? Okay, so we'll go to standard. And then we'll exit this and we'll go to video enhancement. And we're going to go to uh, Super Eagle. Let's see if you guys can see that again, okay? Okay, you guys see that image there? Let's see if it changes right around there. See how it's pixelated? Oh, it switched. <laughs> it switched screen. So let's coin up. Woohoo! Spooky. And let's try this. Uh, game out here guys. that one hit half my power this game was a quarter muncher for sure back in the day in the arcade see that light going off guys that's the bulb is fried so anyway my, my bulbs are coming guys Alright guys, that's a quarter muncher for sure. I just thought it would be cool to show you guys that. Um, let's get into some stuff. How about this? A classic Metal Slug X Super Vehicle. Okay, This was an SNK game back in 1999 it was released. Let's see how she runs. All right, I'm going to have to program this as well, I think. I'll show you guys what happens if we don't, if we don't program it. Actually it might work, so... Alright, so this is how SNK games load up. No flood. Alright, let's see if the coin will go. It is accepting a coin up. Alright, let's see if we can 
stretch out the screen a little bit, guys. Video options. 10 7. Watch this, we're going to stretch it out. Ah, a little bit. We got a little bit out of there. Hipsters over here, these hippies, they actually give you weapons. Check this out. Alright, that's enough of that. Alright, she's running everything that we're throwing at her pretty good. Um, let's do another classic. Um, let's try out some Turbo Splatterhouse. Yeah. So this was released by Namco in 1998. Check this out, boys and girlies. See if we can get the uh, video options. No, that's smaller. Okay, so we'll exit this. We'll go into video enhancements. Go Super Eagle, because I love it. Exit. Let's see if this is already kind of programmed here. Oh yeah! Oh, 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 oh. We got Splatterhouse boys and girlies! Buttons are backwards! Try something else. Um, yep. Let's try. Let's get to some Street Fighter, guys. All right, this is a classic arcade game. This thing is running great, guys. Like this is feeling really good. This is looking great. I know you guys can only see this much on the camera, but with the marquee and everything, I don't want to back it up too much. I want you guys to see a bit of the gameplay. So let's check out Street Fighter 2 Champion Edition. Let me just uh, go into the configuration settings and put this game, player one start, point one. Alright, that looks actually set, so let's exit this. Video options, we'll bring it to a 12.7, hopefully this expands. Yeah, and it just expanded, that's perfect, we're going to have full screen on this. Okay, let's go to video enhancements, we'll just bring it to Super Eagle. We're going to exit this, guys, on pause, and let's try out Street Fighter 2. Point up. Yeah, guys, th this light's really bugging me here. Sounds really good, guys. Round 1.
So that's the Street Fighter running great on that. This this light is really getting on my nerves, guys. I'm sorry. You know, I, I don't think I should have made this video without it. All right, let's try a couple more. Um, let's try out Marvel vs. Capcom for fighting games. One of my best favorite fighting games of all time. Point out. Alright. Best team. Ryu. And Wolverine. From back in the day. Alright. Versus Mega Man and Ryu. See how this goes. Ready. Let's switch them up right off the bat. Oh, he blocks it. You don't need a super powerful computer, guys. Like I said, run a Pentium 4 dual core. You know what I mean? Just a dual core computer. Six gigs of RAM. All right, let's pause this and exit this. Let's try out something else. Uh, what do you want to try? How about? Because I know this video is getting long now, guys. Um, you know what? You know what's hot right now? Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. So you know what? Let's play that. Now this is the four player version so I might be stuck with uh, whatever turtle they want to give me as first. I'm hoping it's at least Leonardo. I like Donatello the best guys. Who's your favorite turtle? Leave a comment. I want to know. Let's see if we can make this look a little bit better here, okay? Video options, please, please, please. 1914, what the hell is that? That's a little bit bigger, okay. So we're gonna exit this. We're gonna go into uh, image enhancements. We're gonna go into Super Eagle. We're gonna exit this. We're gonna go input for this game. Point one. Then we're gonna go player one up. And that's gonna look good anyway. So then we got button one. Button two. All right. Sorry about the uh, <laughs> the distraction there, the, the cutoff in the uh, in the title there, guys. Okay. So let's uh, exit this, exit this, and uh, let's get back to the game. This is gonna look a little bit nicer now too with the super eagle running. See how it makes it pop? All right. Let's point out. Let's take shout. All right. Turtles are back. <laughs> Bring that statue back, you bloated beanbag! 
Big Apple attack. One more, okay? Let's see what else we got here. Let's do some NBA Jam, baby. This is a great game, guys. She's running excellent. You know what? This build is well worth the money, well worth the, the time spent. I probably got close to, I don't know, 50 or 50 hours, 60 hours into the build of this. And you guys can see how beautiful she looks. That one button right there, guys, is really annoying the hell out of me. Okay, but she's looking very, very nice, especially at nighttime. Let's see if I can get the angle for that marquee. Yeah, it's not letting me, guys, but it looks super clear in real life. Okay, let's see how the how the back fans look over here. I know it's really dark, guys, okay? She's looking very nice, okay, guys? I know this was a long video, but uh, this needed to be done. I need to show you guys some gameplay on this, okay, guys? Please, if you guys enjoyed this build, please click that subscribe button underneath. I can use all the help, all the support I can get out here in YouTube, guys. Uh, YouTube's a huge place and I'm just a little guy, you know what I mean? So uh, please, if you guys don't mind, spread this video around, alright, help uh, RetroPro Frank out, you know, give it a like guys, I worked very hard on this, let's see some likes for me guys, okay? Um, actually, over the course of the weekend there's going to be about three or four videos released, uh, I'm going to try my hardest to get everything uh, uploaded onto YouTube this weekend, okay guys? So I've been working very hard between building this and uh, actually uploading the videos and the little bit of editing I've been doing. It's been very difficult, okay, guys? Please give me a like for all my, uh, my hard work, okay? Throw me a subscribe if, you're, if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, guys. It'll be well worth it. I got a lot of good content coming out, okay, guys? All right, so I just want to say to everybody, thank you very much to everyone who's been following this build from uh, start to finish there. Okay, that's great. Everyone who's been leaving comments and likes and sharing this all over the place. Uh, thank you very much, guys. I had to make this video just to wrap everything up, guys. You know? So, yeah, I think she turned out friggin' great. She sounds great. She looks great. She's running everything good. 
Uh, I might actually change that marquee. I might go with something a little bit more bluer. You know, like, don't get me wrong, it's beautiful, okay? But I do have two other options that are already cropped to that size. I might switch it out. It wouldn't cost me much to do it, to get it printed. Oh, I already got the PDF, so... Yeah, guys, uh, please, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I always have great content being uploaded, at least weekly. I try to get out a video a week. Uh, sometimes I do, too. All right, guys, so thank you very much for uh, giving me a hand with this, building this. We've been building this together, okay? And finally, finally, I'm able to enjoy this. We're able to enjoy this together, guys, okay? So once again, thank you very much. Please hit the like, the subscribe button, okay, guys, for all my hard work. All right, and uh, yeah, this is Retro Pro Frank, and I'm out. Guys, thanks for watching the video. If you guys like this video, go ahead and press the like button below. And uh, you guys can leave some comments uh, below in the comment section of the video. Please share this video on Facebook pages to your friends and family. As well as if you guys like this video, please subscribe. This is Retro Pro Frank. Thanks for watching. I'm out.